What up, Munchie Mob? And welcome to another episode of The Munchie Review. And on this episode, we done pulled up to Lancaster, a place called O Hoods. Um, I got my boy Cole Snavely with me, also known as Eli Wyatt in the music world. Uh, they got a 420 theme going on, because it is 420 today, so you know the munchies are in full effect. Um, so yeah, we're going to go in here and uh, check it out and see what it do. But before we do, don't forget to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, don't forget to comment, and yeah, let's go see what's up. Just like that. Cool. What up? Mr. Munchies here. I'm here with my man Cole. He also goes by Eli Wyatt. You gotta check out his music. Yeah. Tell them where they can check out your music. Uh, Spotify, YouTube, uh, iTunes. Uh, it's called the PD, I guess. Put it out about six months ago. Check it out. It's fire. He knows. It's fire. <laughs> Listen, on well, just flaming. Yeah, that's what we do. Yeah, yeah I support sure. it. The Munchy Review supports that. So I yeah. support the Munchy Review. Just like know? that. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna look at these menus and we're gonna decide what it is that we want to get into. For we'll sure. holler back. For sure. This is his niece, April. That's what April. up, what up? All right, so okay, we're about to play a game with April, right? Uh -oh. It's called, What the Hell Is That? What the Hell Is That, okay. Where you can go to the bar, have them make me any drink okay. that you can think of, yeah. and I have to try to guess the ingredients yeah, that are in said absolutely. drink and the alcohol that is in it. Okay, so two waters and a what the hell is that? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Right two waters and a what the hell is that? <laughs> yeah. Perfect. So Abel then brought me this, this here, what the hell is that? It, it looks, hell is it? it looks like that. Y'all see that? It looks like that. It looks good, man. It, look, it looks really good. I'm gonna see if I can figure out what it is. It's good, I know. <laughs> That's gotta have some tequila in it. That's mm. tequila. Um, Dang, I don't know what. What is that? Tangray gin? Is it gin? You know what that is? I don't. I don't either. <laughs> Man, I just drank vodka. <laughs> so. It's definitely not vodka. No. Is it? Is it vodka? No. It's definitely something clear though. Is it? It's not clear. <laughs> I think it, no, it's like darker. Is it a whiskey? Yep. Okay, whiskey. Okay. Man. Whiskey. I, I've never heard of that. Is that an olive on there? Ah, that looks like a... We're about to find out. Frost or um, uh, blueberry? Yes. I want a blueberry. That's <laughs> how you shake your head. That's Whitney. Welcome to the Munchie Review, Whitney. That, that's, Cole's, that's Cole's niece. Might have been a black cherry or something. Blackberry? I don't know. Black, oh, it black was, cherry? Okay. Yeah, maybe. maybe. Black cherry? Uh, <laughs> there's clearly some type of, um, some like lemon, lemon or lemon, li lemon and lime in there. Lemon. Right? Mm. It's tricky though. They and got some whiskey. Man. We got lemon. Yeah. And whiskey and lemon. I don't know what kind of whiskey, but it's whiskey and lemon. Nah, man, it's <laughs> whiskey and there's lemon. He's right. There's whiskey and lemon. That's all I got. So yes. it has organic maple syrup in it, along with yes. the maple bitters. Then it's Bitter. got a tart cherry juice. It's organic tart cherry, so it's got a calming effect. That's very it's got good. Elijah Craig bourbon in it. What's cherry? Lavender. Lavender. That's what, that's cherry bourbon is a cherry liqueur. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right. The name of this drink was uh, Cherry Lips. Cherry Lips. Uh, I, 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 listen, I got I got a lot of it. I didn't get all of it, but I got a lot of it. I didn't get all of it. I think you said all of it. I said it again. <laughs> well, it appears to me that yeah, April has brought the food out. Yo, those look So delicious. that's our homemade jalapeno jam, homemade pickle sauce. That also Bro. goes with the pickle oh. fries right here. Oh. Oh, y'all want to see. Oh. With a whipped garlic butter. Uh, man, right whipped back, garlic friend. butter? Yeah. Oh, I got some up, bro. Pickle fries with some sauce. What you got over here? Man, uh, I read egg rolls with corned beef. I read egg rolls with the corned beef. Cabbage and shit. What you got over there? I got some pizza egg rolls. Some pizza egg and rolls. And some whipped garlic butter. Shoot, some man. whipped garlic butter, like, yeah. Yeah, I'm getting in that. Everything what? is hand battered and homemade, hand rolled right there. So. I heard that. She said everything is hand battered, handmade, right here, just like that. Like, what better way to eat than something fresh? 
Let's get into it. Oh, right there. Oh, my. Oh, my. Yeah, I mean, listen, getting to these pickle fries, pickle fries, I ain't never in my life been looking out. Man. Wow, that's something. That is something. That sure is something, that pickle fry. Man, these egg rolls, corned beef and something. What's this dip? Like a pickle dip? Something. Man. It's something. That's delicious. That's like a root beer rice. Dill pickle. Nice batter. The batter clearly has seasoning on it. Flavor. The sauce is great. This little dipping sauce. Man, oh, what was what? Polaroid of us. This is what a Polaroid of us look like. Man. Man. Just like that. <laughs> Just like that. Y'all, y'all won't get it better. Man, that does look good though. Sauce. Pizza egg roll. Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's where it's at. Let me get in that mind. Yeah, I'm gonna steal this from you. You know. Man, I think the smacking of my lips and the, the silence speaks volumes. Wow. This pizza egg roll is the bomb. Tostitos ain't got nothing. Oh, hell no. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> If ever I was to eat a pizza egg, uh, <laughs> what? This is. Nah, tostitos never again, man. man. These are our appetizers, y'all. Everything is spot on so far. I got stuff all in my teeth. I'm gonna wash it down with this Polaroid of us. Looks like that. All right, y'all. So, this is Whitney. Y'all met Whitney. She, 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 she is Cole's niece. And she's gonna play this game with me called What You Know. And I got three questions for her about old hoods. And if she can get two of these three questions right, then I'm gonna buy her a drink. Fingers crossed. So here we go. And it's multiple choice. Two of them are multiple okay. choice. That's good. One, one, <laughs> one, one of them is true or false. So here we go. Question number one What year did this here location open? A, 2020. B, 2017. C, 1999. Or D, 2012. 2012. Damn. Damn. Oh, man, she was so what confident. was it? 2017. Oh, wow. September good. of 2017. Yeah. All right. My man's prepared. This is cool. Yeah. How many locations do they have? This is question two. A, one. B, two. C, three. Or D, four. There's one. only one. There's only oh, one. No. There's only the one. one all right, it's a moment of truth. She gets this question right, I'm gonna buy her a drink. If she doesn't, she gotta buy her own drink. <laughs> this is true or false? Kevin and Julie Hoodley are the owners of that this here. That is 100% true. No? Absolutely false. Oh. <laughs> the owners are actually Keith and Judy Hood. Oh. Are the real owners. I just what is the name of the Hood? Nope. No. Keith. Oh, yeah, it's, it's so close. Yeah, it's so close. Oh, man. Hey. Hey, that was a, that was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good one. So wait me, y'all. She's a good sport. That's all right. You didn't listen. Yeah. Didn't ah, listen. I was too excited. Question, yeah, I was too excited. Right, I got too excited. I thought she had a good yeah. one. Well, she, she got one out of she got one out of three. All right, so. I have a drink for that. She knows. I'll say she, <laughs> she knows something, which is more than nothing. Yes. Right, right. One out of three. It's important. Better luck next time. Yeah, Thanks, Whitney. <laughs> so good. Food has come out. Basket, my mm, friend. Look at that. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. Salt, Do you like lemon with your fish? <sighs> no, this is this is this is wonderful. What do we think, Flash everybody? I, I is there just anything else I could get you right now? Probably some more napkins. That's exactly. probably about it. Cause I'm about to make a mess. <laughs> His, uh, what's this called? The what? Gateway. This is called the Gateway. It's like a super loaded baked potato. Baked potato. The couch potato. That's the couch potato, which is also a super loaded stuffed baked potato. And then, and then I got this here lovely seafood platter that's got some some cod on there and some. Uh, Tilapia dip and some fries and some shrimp 
What's that? What's that? What's that hitting like? Man, this is incredible. This brisket's on point. Got some caramelized onions on top of there. Oh man, this is on point right here. So the real question is, how are the munchies? Oh man. Fulfilling your munchies? Listen, tell Alexis what's up. Yeah? Definitely what's up. Good. Good. Glad you guys like it. Some egg rolls too. Yeah, Alexi doesn't mess around. No, she don't mess around. Yeah, yeah, for real. Okay, so we're going to have to go to the next one. Yeah, we're going to have to go to the next one. Yeah, we're going to have to go to the that's what's up. Cod is cooked very well. Tastes fresh. Really good. Bro, buttery, buttery on there. I like the sauce I'm dipping it in. I bet this is fresh homemade sauce too. For sure. Now, I got some tilapia dip on here. I'm guessing that's what these crackers are for right here. So we're gonna we're gonna give that a whirl. I'm gonna have to get in on that. Yeah, man, please, please do. A little tilapia dip in my cracker. Oh look, it's like it's like a um, tuna salad with tilapia. <laughs> no. All right. Clams are fried very well. They're not, they're not like chewy, chewy. They got some crisp and some crunch to them. Here for that. How you feeling about your potato over there? Man, it's delicious. Everything about it, brisket's good, good. Caramelized onions. On point, huh? Yep. Where it's at. Whitney, how you doing over there? How's your? Yeah. That's good? Yeah, that's why I'm not talking. Yeah. <laughs> no words. She's like, just don't even put me on right now because I'm feeding my face. I ain't trying to. Plus, you got something right here. A little something right there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is Lexi. Lexi is the chef. All the food that we that we showed y'all here on the Munchie Review, Lexi cooked it all up. So, yeah. compliments to the chef. Compliments to the chef. Thank you so much. All right, y'all, we're about to do a quick review. And we always start with the food. So I'm gonna go first so, so he can see how this goes. All right. I'm gonna get a food of A. Like, why wouldn't I get a food of A? Like, the food was great. Everything that I ate was good. It was all specially made and like flavorful. And it was just, it was the bomb. Lexi yeah. is the chef, that, that's his niece. She did a darn good job. I give the food of A. I get the food today plus for sure. You Lexi, go. you rocked it. No rocked doubt. It. Where you from? Leave it. Drop it. <laughs> We're gonna review that. Yeah. Good job, Lexi. All right. For sure. Service. The service is an A, a plus two. Yeah. Like, April's on top of things. April's on top of things. I bought. I had everything came out quick. She hooked me up on the what the hell is that? She she checked in often to make sure we had everything we need. So. April gets an A plus. A plus. A plus. Sure. Yep. Uh, the ambiance, the ambiance of the place. You know, it's a nice place. Like it's definitely got the Irish pub feel to it. Um, you know, they got some decorations. They up got some decorations. The split night. It's not. It's not huge, but it's you know, it's comfortable. I don't feel. I don't feel people all on top of me. They got different extra rooms or whatnot in there. I get an ambiance a good beat. Yeah, for sure. You know, I'll say, yeah, I'll say B. Yeah, B. A minus. A minus, B. Thanks. Last but not least, the value. I don't know, because I haven't got my bill yet. But oh, I'm going to guess that the value is really good. Looking at the prices on it, looking at the prices of the stuff that I ordered, everything is reasonable. Everything, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, bucks, man. like you, 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 you're going to get what you paid for. And for sure. You're going to get what you paid for. You're going to be full. And you're gonna be happy because it's good. So I get a value. I get a value of a good A too. With it, A. Cool, just For like sure. that. Yeah. So the next question is, would you come back? Absolutely. Of course I would. Why wouldn't I come back? Oh, did you hood. not just did you not just hear? Every time we're in Lancaster. Did? We're oh, coming hood. back. Oh hood. For sure. Oh hood. Yeah. And if you don't know, now you do know. Yes, sir. Quick review. Just like that. All right. All right, y'all. It's been another episode of the Munchie Review down here at O'Hoods in Lancaster. It's my boy Cole, also known as Eli Wyatt. He told you where to find his music at. I suggest you go find it so you can educate yourself. 
get conscious. You know what I'm saying? My man got bars, and, and, and you know, like Mr. Munchie don't approve of everybody, but I approve of that dude. So, my man, I appreciate you bringing me down here. I appreciate you coming with me. You know what I'm saying? Inter introducing me to your nieces. Everybody's super cool. Everybody's sure. treated us like family on folk 20. So you already know what that means. If you don't know, uh, it's about that time, man. You know, um, listen, tip your bartenders, tip your servers, hit like, hit subscribe, don't forget to comment. And last but not least, as you already know, everything always and forever tastes better with the munchies. Just like that. Whoa.